Today, I'm excited to showcase our latest advancements in partnership with Snowflake. We'll explore AI SQL functions to uncover valuable insights from unstructured data and turn our analysis into a powerful chat-based data app, all within Hex. I'm an analyst working for a large utilities company. We have over 10,000 structures that require yearly maintenance and inspection. I've been tasked with putting together a data app that adds metadata about our utility structures and provides an interface for a grounds crew to ask additional questions about each structure. In an effort to modernize and digitize our assets, we use drones to capture images of each tower and pole. Let's begin our exploration. I'm in a brand new Hex project, and to start, I've loaded that image data into a stage in Snowflake. Here, I'm gonna go ahead and move that data from the stage into a brand new Snowflake table that I can begin my analysis on. I'm gonna go ahead and use this AI classify function. This is a brand new function provided by AI SQL within Snowflake. Here, I'm gonna go ahead and define my prompt, and I'm gonna pass in the image file from the table above. I'll go ahead and categorize each of my different poles as being steel lattice, metal pole, or wooden pole. In a similar approach, I want to understand the vegetation, the surrounding effects of each of my towers. So in that case, I'm going to leverage again that AI classify function and look through the actual text information extracted from the inspection report. Here I've gone ahead and queried the power lines table where I get the following information. We have longitude, latitude, voltage, the different classifications of our pole types, as well as the vegetation encroachment, which is vital for the importance of safety and the maintenance of each structure. Within Hex, it makes it really, really easy for me to actually jump in between our SQL cells and Python cells. I can even start weaving in these single value cells for the report that I'd like to share out. We have these neat native visualizations where I can actually pass in that power line data or the base table data that I'd like. And we can even break down the high and low vegetation based on the voltage rating. And lastly, I'd love to just point out uh, each of these structures on a map. So I'll use a friendly little map cell. Now, each individual structure here has its own corresponding file. And I'd love to be able to highlight not only the inspection report, but also the image itself captured by the drone. Now, all of that data is now stored in Snowflake. So let's see how we can extract that. I'll first be pulling the inspection report itself. We can see that it's a very detailed inspection report. And I can also bring in the actual image itself of the structure. So here we have a steel lattice structure, and I'd love to be able to surface this in the final data app that I'll put together using just pure SQL. I'm gonna use the cortex complete function. I'll specify my particular model of interest, and I'm going to pass in a open-ended prompt provided by our user. I'll go ahead and pass in the relative path of our image file, and then we can succinctly send off the image and the user question out to an LLM in Snowflake. With that said, let's see how we can actually turn this into a data app and extract all of this very rich knowledge and turn it into this interactive user experience. So I've gone ahead and opened Hex's app builder. Now this is basically a blank canvas that allows me to take the assets from my notebook and move them over to an app builder, which lets me in a drag and drop like fashion, style and curate this final data. app. So if I'd like to actually add one of these cells over, it simply is selecting the appropriate tab or adding it back in and we'll see it follows the structure of our notebook logic. I can go ahead and drag and drop it into place. And here we are, the final data app that's ready to be shared with our stakeholders. We started out this analysis by working with some unstructured data, mailing the form of our drone images and the inspection reports. So let's explore this app very briefly. We have this nice map that indicates vegetation encroachment, and we see that there's a few in particular that are causing some concerns. We have this image 0070, I may want to do some exploration or an understanding of the maintenance that was done prior. I can come in and search this. So 0070. We can go ahead and trigger a search. Finally, if I did want to ask any specific questions, like is there any overflashing risk associated to this, we can go ahead and look at that ex exact image and we can ask it a question. Let's go ahead and trigger this search. And here we have it, a nice structured response coming back from our LLM. It's telling us that this appears to be having adequate insulation and there's proper spacing between the components. If you'd like to try this out for yourself, I'll leave the link down below in the description and thank you for watching.